Hey ya, it's your girl Buya and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, your girl will be doing this summer bridal makeup look. So this look was requested by at Elidia Jessel on my Instagram DM. So, my message niya ako. Sabi niya na she's going to be married soon. So, congratulations, Miss Elidia Jessel. So, Mapus, please congratulate niyo din siya. And sa mga ano din, mag-get married this year, congratulations sa inyo in advance. So, I agreed to do this summer bridal makeup tutorial kasi sabi ko sa kanya na this will be my wedding gift for her. Okay. So, yung mga products dito na gagamitin ko for this tutorial, I made sure that it's affordable and locally available or basta accessible siya. And she also requested na sana po yung look hindi gagamit ng liquid eyeliner. Di ko pa kasi talaga alam gamitin yun. So, for this look, hindi din ako gagamit ng liquid eyeliner. But the makeup look will still look bomb even though walang eyeliner na gagamitin. By the way guys, since season ngayon ng coronavirus, ang daming scares about it and nagulo yung buong mundo dahil sa coronavirus. I'm praying for everyone's safety and of course stay healthy stay informed and stay sanitized guys also guys please avoid yung mga news outlet or yung mga fake news kasi mayroong mga sites guys na they do it for clickbait only and it will bring you to ad farms therefore they will gain money so an ad farm is a landing site or a website na madaming ads and then it also contains the fake news guys pero yung purpose talaga nun is to bring a user to an ad farm so that the fake news outlet will gain money. Kaya I cannot stress enough how important it is to stay away from fake news or mga news outlets because um, they're also using this opportunity to make money. And not only that, it is causing panic. So the more panic, the more media can use it for their purpose. The fake media, guys. So please avoid the fake news. Please avoid fake media. Rely lang kayo sa mga reputable sources, okay? Let us not let the scare or let the fear control our lives. Avoid muna mga crowded places, okay? Stay at home, stay quarantined, and stay safe. So guys, without any more further to do, let's proceed to the tutorial. Important talaga sa bridal makeup na mag-skincare routine kayo. Prep nyo yung skin nyo well according to your skin's needs. Now, since summer bridal makeup excuse me that wasn't ladylike. Anyway, since summer bridal makeup yung gagawin natin, of course, important na mag-sunscreen tayo. So, nakapag-sunscreen na ako. Pero, again, mag-sunscreen ako ulit, but with a tinted sunscreen naman. So, what I'm gonna be using is Bellos Tinted Sunscreen. So, meron siyang SPF PA++++. Okay. The reason why I'm using this is because I'm using this as my primer. And at the same time, I'm using it as my added sunscreen. And then, I'm gonna be applying it with my NYX buffing brush. I'm so sad because it's not available here in the Philippines anymore. Kasi parang nag-close na yung NYX cosmetics. So, I really want you guys to try this out sana. Kasi ito din yung ginagamit ni Jackie Aina eh. Pero, if may tita or tito kayo or relatives doon sa states, then pa-request kayo guys ng brush na to. Anyway, ayun nga, ina-apply ko lang siya sa buong face ko and also the neck. Okay, even the forehead area. Uh, usually, I don't put sa forehead area ko, guys. Pero since sunscreen siya, I'm gonna be putting it on my forehead as well. Pero later, guys, pag nag-apply na ako ng foundation na my coverage, I won't be applying on my forehead. Alright, so if wala naman kayo masyadong blemishes, then you can skip the next step. But ako, since meron akong mga blemishes, dark marks, then I have to add foundation na my coverage. So the foundation that I'm gonna be using is ito yung L'Oreal Infallible. This is in the shade 106 Sun Beige. And I'm just gonna be applying a small amount Muna, and then I'm gonna build it up. And then after that, guys, I'm gonna be sculpting my face using Everbelena Sculpt and Strobe. So this is in the shade, anong shade to? Medium, okay? I'm in the shade medium. And then I'm gonna be blending it using my Focalure Blush Brush. So part ito ng face set nila, guys. So you can buy this brush set sa Shopee. It's only for around 200 pesos. Napaka mura niya, guys. But you'll be getting around 7 pieces or 10 pieces of brushes. So, super mura. You have to find it on Shopee, guys. Ang dami ng mga boost na bumili ng brush nito kasi sobrang ganda and sobrang mura lang. 
And then for my cheeks, I'm gonna be using BLK's Mini Soft Matte Mousse. So this is in the shade Moonstone. So ito yung pinili ko kasi ito yung may pagka pinkish peach na colors. Bet ko talaga yung mga pinkish peachy colors. That's why I'm using this. And it's just a nice color for summer bride. And then with the same blush brush, I'm gonna be using this to blend out the mousse. If you guys notice, I build up ako twice ng blush because I really want the blush to. Okay, so next is I'm gonna be setting my face na. So the powder that I'm gonna be using is from Bench Beauty. So ito yung powder foundation nila. This is in the shade Fair. And I'm just gonna be lightly dusting it on the face, guys, since napaka matte ng foundation na ginamit ko. And then yung lip product na ginamit ko is a mousse type, guys. Medyo dry siya on my face. Next guys, magkilay naman tayo and for my eyebrows, I'm gonna be using Blythe Cosmetics Brow Trio. This is in the shade Meteor. 211 Meteor. So a lot of you guys are asking me, Ate Buya, ano ba yung recommend mo na affordable na eyebrow product? And eto talaga guys, yung recommend ko, yung Blythe Cosmetics na Brow Trio. And the reason for that is because not only is it super duper affordable guys, but you'll be getting three products in one. So you'll be having, so merong brow powder, Merong eyebrow gel and then meron siyang brow pencil. And aside from three products makukuha nyo, yung quality niya maganda din. Kaya ni-recommend ko talaga yung product na to. By the way, I rarely use the brow powder. I only use the brow pencil and the brow gel. So, yung gagamitin natin is, of course, yung brow pencil and yung brow gel. And then, I am just gonna be filling in my eyebrows. And I first start with the brow tail area. So, if you don't know the brow anatomy, so guys, diba, ito yung kilay, okay? Tapos, if you have the kilay into two, yung side na to is called the brow tail. Kasi parang tail siya. And then, yung side na to is yung brow head. So, usually guys, when I do my kilay, yung darkest side is yung brow tail area. Diyan ako nalagay ng products first. Because tinatansya ko pa yung pulse ko if it's a little bit heavy or tama lang. And the reason for that, if heavy yung application, at least nandito lang siya sa brow tail area. So, medyo acceptable pa siya. Pero if heavy agad yung application dito sa brow head area, nagiging boxy yung kilay tingnan. Kaya, dito muna ako nag apply and then I adjust na slow to the brow head area. Alright, so now tapos na ako sa kilay, I'm gonna be heading on to my eye makeup na. So this eye makeup is gonna be super duper 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 simple. So first, lalagay muna ako ng base for my eyes. So the base that I'm gonna be using is not a concealer, not a foundation either, not even a contour, but yung ginamit ko for my cheeks which is yung BLK Mini Soft Matte Mousse in the shade Moonstone. And then guys, I'm gonna be going over this eyeshadow with my Caroline Play to Slay palette. So I'm gonna be going over with this shade, guys. Para hindi siya gaano ka pink, okay? So ito, yan, etong shade na to. And then this eye makeup brush, guys, if you're wondering, I got it from Clover Collection, guys. And then to smoke out my lower lash, guys, I'm gonna be using the same color, guys, that I used for my lids. And then yung eye makeup brush naman, guys, na gagamitin ko is from Clover Collection din, pero flat brush naman siya. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of shimmer, guys, on my lids. And I'm gonna be grabbing this color. Ay, wait, ito. Yan. Pero very lightly lang guys, as in literally, i-dust ko lang siya all over my lid, especially dito sa center ng eyes ko. So since yung request ni Elidia Jessel ay to skip the eyeliner, so I'm gonna be skipping it. So next guys is mag na ako, mag apply na ako ng mascara. So um, yung curler ko guys is from Bokto. And then the mascara I'm gonna be using is from L'Oreal. So this is their Voluminous Lash Paradise. This will last you the whole day and even night. Hindi ko na kailangan mag-retouch ng mascara kasi ano 
na siya, carry na siya, kahit one application lang. So, for events, napaka-perfect talaga to. So, guys, I figured, since I only a Lydia Jessel yung nag-apply ng eyeliner, I'm gonna be skipping applying falsies as well kasi if mahirap mag-apply ng eyeliner, I'm pretty sure mas mahirap mag-apply ng falsies. Kahit walang falsies, guys, maganda na yung look, okay? Tingnan nyo naman. You don't need falsies for this look. It is good on its own. So, next, guys, I'm gonna proceed with my lippy naman. So, the lippy that I'm gonna be using is, you guessed it, yung BLK Mini Soft Matte Mousse. Again, in the shade, yung ginamit natin sa cheeks natin, okay? Yung shade na Moonstone. So yun guys, so this is my look for the summer bridal makeup tutorial. I hope you like it. So there are some steps that I skipped like yung eyeliner or yung pag-apply ng falsies is because I re I catered to Elidia Jessel's needs. And also guys, I skipped applying highlighter is because she said she has oily skin and even for and even for people na dry and combi yung skin type like me, the reason why I skipped applying highlighter is because it's for a whole day event. So habang event to guys and mag-oil up talaga yung skin natin and mag-glisten talaga siya throughout the day. Mas magiging oily tingnan yung face natin throughout the day if mag apply pa tayo ng highlighter. So for events like this guys, I skip na applying highlighter kasi yung magiging highlighter ko na is yung oils, your natural oils ko. So, napaka-rare lang talaga yung mga instances na nag apply ako ng highlighter pag gustong-gustong-gusto ko lang talaga. Pero sa mga moments na pwede ko naman skip, then I skip applying highlighter. So, that's it for this tutorial, guys. I hope you like this look and perfect talaga siya kahit bride ka man or ikaw yung maid of honor or bridesmaid ka or kahit guest ka lang. This, is, this look is perfect for your summer wedding event. Okay? So let me know guys in the comment section below if you like this look. And also guys, if you're planning to recreate it, then please do post it on Instagram and tag me. I would super duper love to share it guys. So again, if you like this tutorial, then please do give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and share this video. And if meron kayong makeup or beauty questions or suggestions, then please do message me on my Instagram. It's at Makeup by Buya. My DM is open 24 7 again if you have any more makeup or video suggestions then please do enter them down in the comment section below just remember no hate just love